just wanted to give you guys an up close of some stuff I usually don't post very much. Just a random assortment of personal finds. <clears throat> All from Northeast Oklahoma. This one's a pretty cool knife. Would have been a monster point at one time. I'm guessing it broke, knocked the ear off. Then they resharpened it into a knife. Pretty cool. I found this one in a creek around northern Oklahoma. It's a nice grand point. It's a Hopewell style. Heat treated. In person, out in the sunshine, it's this one's pretty vibrant colored. Yellow and pink, pretty bright. Another Hopewell point. And this one's from a big river here in northeast Oklahoma. Neighbors hammering on something over there, excuse that. Some kind of woodland point, probably like a cup or motley maybe. It's real pretty though, it's translucent kind of. Pretty blue colored. Nice heat treated point right here. Got some stripes and banding in it. Cool little drill. Baron Fort Chert. Another heat treated point. Beautiful heat treat on it. This is a creek find. This was the first blunt point I ever found. I was pretty happy with it. I'd always wanted to find one. You don't really see too many of them here in these parts. Still unsure what type that is. It's kind of calf creaky to be honest, but probably not. This one's a killer. I call it an Afton or a Ucha. I think it's a I think it's a Afton though. You can kind of see the pentagonal shape forming. Maybe it's like a Williams, I don't know. It's a killer though, I know that. This is probably one of my favorite Hopewell points I've ever found. Surface found. All of these are surface finds. This one's from a river. It's a killer. Pretty killer point right there. Good size, nice and thin. I found this in the same exact spot, to be honest, in the river. That's that last point. I think that last one's a grand, where this might be too, but it's a little different. It might be like a Gibson. I don't really know my Hope Wheels too much, but... It's a cool material. It's white and kind of rusty, yellowy. It's got some stripes in it. Really don't know what that stone is, but it's pretty.
This is a creek fine. Oklahoma Creek find. It's got some cortex remaining on it. I always think it kind of looks like Homer Simpson. That's a killer too. Oh, this is one of my favorite points. Still kind of unsure what it is, but I think it might be like a bell. It's a bell or a pelican lake, or maybe even like a ray point, or maybe even an untyped point, honestly. It's hard to pick up, but there's stripes all in it. It's a heat treated point. curious to see what you guys think of some of these like I said I don't show a lot of these too often I found this one quite a long time ago pretty killer Here's one kind of like that last one. Kind of pelicany lakey. The last one had a stack in the same spot. That's funny. Very interesting too. gonna be kind of a long video but I guess it's worth it I think this might be naviculite or naviculite however you say it this would be one of my only points made out of it I think if it is it's gray and white colored partially translucent This one right here was also a creek fine. It's missing one ear. Sharp as heck though. delicate little ears on that thing there's another one just like it almost kind of Texas looking -y. here's another one of my favorite points the day I found this I found 14 points I found these two the same day hang on let me flip them Two of my best corner notches I've ever found the same exact day. I still don't really know what either one of them is typed, but killer, I know that. Kind of a weird offset little base.
pretty cool material on this one. It's all spider webbed. I don't know if that's showing or not. I believe this is a variety of Reed Springs shirt. There's 30 different kinds of ways it can be. Excuse me, that kind of sound is stupid. There's 33 different variations of Reed Springs shirt. This is one of them. Very popular material here in Northeast Oklahoma. I'm sure I have a, yeah. This is classic Reed Springs right here. It's gray, kind of a mottled gray. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and cut this off, but hope it wasn't too stupid of a video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Have a killer day.